Hi guys, welcome back. My name is Sonforia and we are back in our Tinker World. Let's tinker! Woohoo! And we are here already with our lovely husband Riley. How are you today? I almost walked into a lava pit the other day. That wouldn't have been good. No, it wouldn't have been good. So please stay away from lava. Stay in this room where you are safe. Um, yeah, so since the last episode, I did um some minor changes to the household um i organized well organized redid all of this pit so it actually looks like it's sat on a hill and not floating in the middle of nowhere um i'll show you the why wow, those ladders are there in a second and then i also changed out here i did oops pressing crouch instead of run although i can't run because i'm hungry oh i do have some stick let's have some stick fabulous uh, so I did a little path over to, oh, just checking there's no monsters around. Probably should have checked that first. A little path down to the lovely village. And then I also made some improvements to where the ravine was. So just over this two block high little wall is the actual ravine. Uh, I heard a spider. But I can't see him, he probably is in the ravine. Down there, and I just covered it over so that nobody would fall in. And the same with this bit here, because it was here. Hi, donkey. And as you can see from the house, um, we have like a little house on top of our house. Um, and I added that on, because we definitely needed more room. And this is where our lovely ladders go. Up here, and there's a bed, because I needed to sleep. Uh, but yeah. So that is everything that I have done this episode, uh, since the last episode, should I say. So what I want to do today is, um, I collected a load of dye, oh, where is it? I've got these chests. So I collected a load of dye, and um, to craft stuff in the Deco Craft mod, you need these little pieces of crafting clay, and you use red, green, and blue. So we need some lapis, and we also need some cactus green dye. To, and you use sand and dirt to make the clay um, so you can just make a piece just so I can show you and then I need to go and actually obviously find the other colors but I thought um, in the village I found loads of poppies so why not make some while I'm there so there we go it just makes four pieces and then you can use that to craft different beds and stuff um, some more dyes that I found in there uh, yeah that was really cool. So the first thing that I wanted to do was actually go out and get those sheep that I'd seen. Because I went over, um, they're just over there, I went over and, sh do I have any iron? Uh, I have iron tools, but I don't think I have any, oh, are these stone tools? I, I don't know, I don't know. No, I don't have any iron. No shears, we'll just kill them. Um, so I, I, I got some of the sheep from over here to obviously make my bed, but we are going to need some more. Um, so I'm sure I left a few. I'd rather shear them and come back, but we can't, so I have to kill them. Sorry, Mr. Sheep. I think we only need, we need two. Um, I think we only need two pieces. But we'll see. Is that it? Oh, no, there's another one over here. Sorry, Mr. Sheep. Thank you. Oh, pumpkins. We have loads of them. Yes, we're not getting anything different. Because we need the special bushes. Bush, bushes. Bushes. Um, so we still ha also have that other village for us to go and whoop, investigate. But again, we can do that at a later date. That's not a problem. So if I remember rightly, um, in this deco craft, uh, mod you can have as well as um, some crazy beds as I'm sure oh, I need the bed as I'm sure you've seen um, you can also change the color of a normal bed I think but I'm not 100% sure because I also had a look at it and you actually get a deco craft bench which is like a workstation which you need um, the cactus green the lapis and the other the red dye and then I can't remember what else it was I can't remember oh there yeah there you can see it look uh, let me have a look see if we can find it so 
so I can show you guys what it was I meant. So these are the normal beds, look. It won't show me how you craft. Oh, so I need to be. I'm still not in a crafting table. I. Then you got these fancy beds, but I'm not too fussed about those. Where's the? Oh, here it is. Deco bench. So I need a piece of clay, or I need a crafting table. And I need. If I use the clay, I can just use the the dies. Or if I use the crafting table, I need to use the uh, actual crafting clays. But that's what I need to make some of those. So I'm kind of hoping. Um. So it wouldn't, why wouldn't it show me how to make these beds? Do I need the crafting, the crafting table? I was kind of hoping that it would just let me, let me do it. So let's do this. And this. No. No. Oh, okay. Maybe not. I'm sure that's how it said we could do it. Oh, well, let's go put our bed back and sleep in it. I think we need the deco craft. Um crafting bench to change it into a, a, a normal coloured bed I guess so we'll have to try and get the other colours to do that um, and the other thing I wanted to do today was we have our materials a new book here which is from the Tinker's Craft the Tinker's Construct sorry so what I thought we would do is actually build some of these so we need to make um, a blank pattern and a stencil table so we need sticks and planks and then planks and the pattern so have I got sticks and planks I certainly have so if we put these like this and these like this we get blank patterns if I put a blank pattern and was that it that way around we get a stencil table oh and a book cool so okay we got two books <laughs> didn't think that was gonna happen so um, this can be, uh, we need a downstairs really. I do look tired, thanks, I feel tired. Uh, we'll put this in here for now because, um, yeah. Uh, one of these is going to be the living room and kitchen. Which actually might be that one because he hangs out in it all the time. And the other one was going to have um, kind of a stairway to downstairs. So we might as well use this one. So we have, oh, that is not what I wanted to do. Thank you. So we've got them. And then we can use a piece and a log to make a pa part crafter and then a piece and a chest to make a pattern chest. So I have a log which we can make a parts builder and then we need to make a chest on one of these to make a patterns chest so we can go and put these down I'm assuming I can just put them next to each other I don't really know okay so I can put can I put the blank patterns in there no okay so basically what this is all about is using different ores to make better tools and weapons and things like that and you can make stencils to make different weapons and then you can use different ores to make them and then yeah, you can like add different things onto them like fire and stuff to make them work quicker and things like that. So we can also use the blank pattern and a crafting table to make a tool station. So we'll do that. The other thing we need to make is seared bricks. So we need sand, gravel and clay to make grout. So let's just, okay, so let's make us a crafting table. So we now have a tool station too. I don't know if these need to be in a specific order, but they're not right now. And then we've got materials new volume two and Tinker's weaponry. Um, so let's just we'll chuck these all in here. Uh, and we uh, blah, 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 blah. we need to cook this meat. That would be a good idea. Um, Cool, and let's put this die away, not in there, in here, put this away, don't need them, they can stay together, don't need you, don't need the seeds, oh, no fence. oh my, my chest is so messed up now, um, anyway, yeah, so we need to go and find ourselves some clay, and we do have a lot of sand, so we don't need sand, we need clay and we need gravel. 
So our best bet is to look um, around here, really. So this is sand. So we've got plenty of sand. Oh, here's gravel. We'll take some of this. We're going to need quite a lot of seared brick because we use it to build the uh, smeltery, which is what we're going to need to obviously make all our tools in. Oops, I'm drowning. Oops, we're drowning. We're drowning. <sighs> Keep forgetting about that. Must watch bubbles. If you don't want to drown and die, collecting gravel, that is, that's not the way to go. Uh, let's float back up, very slowly. Now what's this? Oh, it's just sand. Okay, so we need clay. Clay, clay, clay. What's this? Oh, it's clay! Mwahaha! <laughs> Perfect. So everything we need is in this area, which is nice. Definitely makes a nice change having to run around everywhere trying to find everything that you need. So we'll just collect all of this up and then we'll go and make some seared bricks. Uh, we're not going to make the smeltery this episode because I'm going to have to, it's quite big, so I'm going to have to build either like, oops, oops, drown it, drown it, oops, oops, oops. I'm going to have to build either like an outside shed or um, an underground room like I said I probably was going to build just to uh, to house it all really because it's quite big it's going to take up a lot of room so we want to make sure that we have the space to do it so we've got a stack and a bit of clay um, and I know we don't have a lot of gravel but we've got some grout and then we have to put the grout in the furnace I believe let's get some of this sand cool and then let's put this in here. Sand. Uh, cool. Let's just make as much as we can. Where's my button? It's not doing it. There we go. Cool. And we need to. How much of this have I got? Oh, just enough to make another furnace. Fabulous. So we'll put that there. And this will burn it. And we can put that in there. And then we can take our lovely steak out and we can actually have one of those so we'll eat that and then hopefully oh, we've got some flint as well that's always nice so i definitely need to sort out these chests as well um there we go seared bricks and then um if i get the book uh, um, so we need four seared bricks to make a actual brick we need eight to make a controller because the other thing that we need to do is make like the bit that holds the lava that powers it uh, but we'll make some bricks Let's see what they're like oh great we only get one oh, that's helpful oh we got mighty smelting oh here we go so we need a smeltery controller, a seared tank, nine seared bricks, any combination of ten seared bricks, seared tanks or drain faucets, or drains, and one faucet and a casting table. Okay, so we need quite a bit of stuff. So let's go and make a control thing. Uh, okay. Maybe I should have put this on the other side, so... We've got two bricks and a control thing. We need to make a... Where is all my wood? Uh, because we need... I feel like we need a chest just for the tinker's stuff right now. Um, hmm, yeah. Let's put it there. So, put all this in. Uh, might as well take these out. Because I'm going to need those. Uh, book, book. I need a bookshelf. That's what I need. Uh, lovely, lovely. I didn't think it was going to give me that, but it gives me lots of experience, which is nice. Uh, so that's the last one of those, and we've just got one more of those. Cool. So that is all the steered bricks we're going to be able to make. So we've got four, so we definitely need quite a bit more. So um, 
we're lacking in the gravel really that's all we need so i'm going to go back out and get that um but i hope you enjoyed this episode it's been a bit mismatched of us trying to figure out different um mods and stuff but we're definitely getting there um i'm gonna maybe in this room maybe do like a a, a way down from here or something like a trap door here but i'm gonna dig out underneath the house or should i do it outside hmm I don't know whether to just build it out here. I might just build it out here just because it's lava. It scares me a bit. So I might just do it over here. Um, I'm just going to clear some space anyway wherever I decide to do it. Um, to put the smeltery. And um, try and get some more gravel so that we can finish that in the next episode. And uh, yeah. So we're well on our way to starting to collect some crazy ores. So we can start making our first lovely tools. Because um, I've seen some really cool ones. So I hope you really enjoyed it and I will see all of you guys soon. Bye guys!